Hi guys, and welcome back to Quantum Leap Year, the review series on the channel where I review all the episodes of classic Quantum Leap in honour of the show's 30th anniversary. So I'm up to season two, episode three of these reviews now, and that would be for the Americanization of Makiko. <clears throat> which was written by Gilbert Shilton, directed by Charlie Coffey. Um, the Leap E in this case is Charles Lee McKenzie. The date of the Leap is August 4th, 1953. And the location is Oak Creek, Ohio. The episode originally aired on October 11th, 1989. Production code 65406. Viewed by 14.1 million on its original transmission. Synopsis of the episode. Sam leaps into Charles Lee McKenzie, played by Bill Arnold, a U.S. Navy aviation machinist mate. Returning to the family farm in Ohio with Makiko, played by Leela Lee Olsen, his Japanese bride, after being stationed in Japan for two years. Sam must help his host's mother, played by Kay Callan, accept his new bride, fend off the advances of his ex-girlfriend, played by Elena Stratella, or Stratella, whatever, however you pronounce that, and fight off a potentially deadly response from Rusty, played by Patrick Massett, a racist veteran of World War Two. No, this is the second of two episodes where Sam leaps into a host after his own conception, but before his own birth. Revealed in the series finale to be August 8th, 1953. Four days after the date in this episode. This differs from the two episode The Leap Back. Or episodes The Leap Back and The Leap Between the States. Which contradicted the show's construct of Sam leaping within his lifetime. Though the reasons for those events are explicitly explained in both those episodes. So that's the basic information you need on the Americanization of Makiko. It's a good episode, well worth a watch. Of course, I'm reviewing. These from my memories of them. Okay, now. Um, the next episode up for review will be Season 2, Episode 4. What Price Gloria? Until then... If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, share and subscribe. Thanks for watching and have a magical time.